My love of aviation and of traveling goes way back. Otters, beavers and Norsemans, oh my, buzzing all over town, landing on the lakes and adorning oh so many docks. When I moved to Red Lake, Ontario, the float planes totally captured my soul and reignited my passion for aviation and I knew that's what I had to follow. I can't say the road to becoming a pilot has been super smooth. I mean, I've been trying to become a pilot for so many years and it never worked out yet. Any normal person would have given up by now, but I'm not normal and had almost given up on my dream until I got an acceptance letter from FNTI. This is it, it's the big day. I am so nervous, but so excited. This is a dream come true. Back when I lived in Red Lake, I did take some flying lessons, um, but I was always wishing and praying that someday I could just be immersed totally in aviation and really get it, like really integrated. And today that dream is coming true. My flight boot camp begins today. I'm here. I made it. I'm going to meet everyone now. So this first week is about getting used to my new surroundings and my new routine. So the first day was quite exciting. We got to go up on a discovery flight and check out the area we'll be flying out of. Since I'm mostly a country girl at heart, I was very happy to see that Southern Ontario Anyways, where I am right now is a lot more calm and farmy than I thought. It's less densely populated. I'm not heading to Toronto anytime soon. I'm gonna stick to this side of Southern Ontario. Sophie, where are you staying while you're in flight school? And the answer is here, there, everywhere. I usually try to find a spot with water, of course, because you know my obsession with water. Tonight, there's just a little creek here and I'm parked in a cemetery. Okay, it's not just a cemetery, it's also a park and a community garden. I'm gonna go check it out.
the next three months will be intense. I can tell just by the first week how intense it's going to be. I do want to share the journey with you. I'm not sure how much I'll be allowed to share. I know we're not really supposed to be filming in the plane so as not to distract us, especially being beginners like this, but I will definitely share the journey with you, although it'll probably drop down to one video every second Monday. All right, so hang in there, follow my journey, click like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'm so excited for this journey. Please keep your fingers and toes crossed for me that everything goes well. Talk to you later.